Kia ora. Um, just thought today I'd have a quick yarn to you about how to cook a crayfish. I was lucky enough that my mate Albie uh, dropped one round to me uh, this afternoon. He'd been out for a dive and uh, thought that uh, I deserved a crayfish. So um, let's go through the steps I'll go through to cooking a cray. First of all, you need a crayfish. Um, this one's quite a big one. Uh, well, well legal. And I've got a pot here of fresh water. I'm just going to put the crayfish in the fresh water. Once he's sitting in the fresh water, completely covered in fresh water, we'll let him sit there for 10 15 minutes until he goes to sleep. Well, it's a bit later. I um, had dinner, let him sit there for about 25 minutes. Um, look at that sunset. And um, the crayfish is, is well dead now. Um, I'm going to take him out, I'm going to change that water and then bring that water to the boil. Okay, that water's just come to the boil, I've just dropped him in. Um, we're going to wait till that water starts boiling again and then we're going to uh, boil him for 15 minutes. So you can see some bubbles starting to show on the bottom of the pot there. So um, it's now 25, 27 past 7, uh, we'll come back. Uh, 15 minutes so uh, let's call it quarter two and um, take him out of the pot well it's definitely boiling the pot's boiling over about three or four minutes to go and he'll be done here comes the bushcraft cat she can sniff a feed. Hey Mia. Yeah, bushcraft cat, she likes the crayfish. I'll be fighting her for a feed. Well, it's quarter two, so time to turn it off. So just to refresh, bring the water to the boil, cook the crayfish for 15 minutes after the water boils. Now this rule works for any size of crayfish because the smaller ones, um, they come to the boil quicker. And now what we'll do is we'll dump that water out and I'll start flushing it down with cold water to stop it from overcooking. Like I said, she's waiting, she's hungry. Um, just got the crayfish in the cold water there and I'll let that tap run for five minutes or so to cool it down and I'm going to put it in the fridge and have it for lunch tomorrow. Uh, just a couple of wee things to point out, um, when we put the cray in the pot, um, it did appear to be twitching a little bit, believe me it was well dead, that's just uh, as the muscles begin to contract a bit from the heat of the water, that crayfish was definitely dead. Um, yeah, um, so don't worry about that. And um, yeah, some people like the crayfish warm, I prefer it cold. Um, so yeah, I'll just let this thing sit for 15 minutes and then um, uh, enjoy it tomorrow for lunch. Anyway, thanks for watching. Um, if you've got any other ways that you cook your crayfish, feel free to add that at the end. Thank you.